What do I do? I don't know how I'm gonna keep the secret. I can't tell DJ, but he needs to know. Okay, I need to talk to the love expert. Who's the love expert? Let's think, 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 DJ. I mean, not DJ. What the heck? I'm Jerry. Okay, think, think, think. Oh, I'll talk to Charlie. God, he's like a whole demon. What's up, guys? I'll be right back. I just have to uh, go talk to Charlie. Um, okay, man. Maybe he's having diarrhea. We better not get the diary on the stairs. And if he did, he didn't even flush. Oh, sick. Or wash his hooves. Oh, sick. We, oh, man. Man, we just had this place cleaned by the maids. Now we're going to have to do it again. <laughs> it over with the car and then i buried it and stuck needles in its eyes yep hey uh dj can i talk to you for a second just like one itty bitty minute man i swear if you peed on the stairs again no no it's not you're that. the one it's that's calling that. the maids yeah now we can off girl talk now okay so have you ever dreamed about sticking needle into boys um no you should try it All right, man, where'd you pee? I didn't pee anywhere. It's so sad. Charlie was kissing the Big Mac picture. How could you do this to me? Jerry, I have no idea what sick and twisted fantasy you're living in, but she, my guitar, my baby. But yeah, I mean, you two aren't even together. I know, but I love her, man. Oh, sick. I love her. Dude, I just want to Do you not realize her. how a big dimwit Charlie is? You'd have so much better. No, Like, perfect. you'd be better off marrying, like. Oh. No, don't you dare. You'd be better off marrying Cheryl. No! But she's so My shallow. Ears. Cheryl is shallow. Cheryl's not shallow. She's just, like, really quiet and, like, emo and, like, you know, kind of really doesn't care about anybody's well-being. I know, but, but I was a sweet girl like Charlie, and she was kissing a big Mac picture. Yeah, Charlie's shallow. I mean, she likes One Direction. Charlie was kissing a big Mac picture. Oh, my gosh, you get over it. Charlie's a dimwit. You'd be better with Cheryl. Cheryl? But she's so shallow. No, she's not. She just doesn't care about anybody else but herself. That's not shallow. That's selfish. I know, but I just... Oh. Dang it, Jerry, you peed. <laughs> wow, I feel really, really awkward. Oh, my gosh. What is with all the screaming? Mom, call the man! Why? Because there's been an accident! <sighs> it's a jerry, it's a jerry. Yeah. Okay, I'll call the maid. You guys have a maid? Yeah, mainly for jerry, and when dad overclogs the toilet with poo. And also we're royalty! Oh, the rabbit, I touched it! Oh my gosh! I have to have a whatever it's called, what is it called? I don't know. Exorcism. Yes, I have to have an exorcism. Hey, you want to touch my Mr. Fluffykins? From the looks of it, no. Oh darn! It looks like we're just me and you. <laughs> I know. Sorry, I peed. It's okay, man. The main took care of it. But you know, Matt, see, Jared, you seem to move on. You know what I mean? I mean, Charlie's just a dimwit. You know, this is this is your moment. I mean, you know what I mean? Ch I mean, uh, if Charlie was gonna, you know, I mean, even though she's a dimwit, it's not like I hate her. I mean, you know, if she was gonna, like, you know, fall off a cliff, I might possibly save her if my hooves wouldn't get dirty. You know what I mean? Yeah, but I would definitely save her. Or, you know, there's a zombie apocalypse. If I was gonna die, I'd probably shield myself with Charlie. But, you know, she'd be good for the humanity what? reasons. Well, I mean, let's think about it. Who would be best to save humanity? Me or Charlie? I'm doing it for the people. I'm doing it for the greater good of mankind. I'm gonna be the best zombie killer ever. I know, right? Yeah. Man, there needs to be a zombie apocalypse so I can show my skills. And then Charlie can just be the shield. But, you know, in the end, we find a cure with Kira, you know what I mean? But she'll just be the sacrifice in the beginning. Oh, I'll get it, I'll get it. It's probably... <laughs> Twilight, 
and Spike. Hey, Shiny. Whoa, look at his lips. They're all, like, puffed up. Shining. <laughs> oh, I mean, you look great. Well, he's doing really, actually really well. He's on his road, he's on the road to recovery, and he's, ah, it's been wonderful. He's been doing so much better. Isn't that right, Spike? Yeah. Hey, everybody. Hey, Twilight and Spike looking good. Thanks. <laughs> He just has a little trouble walking, but for the moment he's been doing. He's been eating. He's been awake. He what happened had to, be... to Spike? We don't know. Um, he showed up at Fluttershy's house in a bag. I remember he's in a bag, and I heard a dog. Ugh. It's okay, Spike. You don't need to remember. As long as you get better, that's all that matters. Oh, hey. Oh, hello, Twilight. Do you mind if I um speak with you? You know, grown up talk. You know, in the other room. Oh, um, yeah, that's fine. Um, uh, could you shy? I d uh, hey, hey, Jerry, could you could you keep an eye on Spike? Oh, not? sure, of course. All right, hey, buddy. I I'm coming. <laughs> Growing up girl stuff, saying it like, oh, I can't hear it because my ears are too young. I'm probably just talking about periods. Oh, don't say that. That's totally inappropriate. It's true. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> You know, Cadence, you should tell them. I mean, there's nothing to be nervous about. I know. I was going to tell them that someone came here, like Jerry and Cheryl. Well, I'm sure they'll be happy to hear it anyways. Come on, I'll do it with you. Come on, let's go. Okay, I'm so nervous. So you're saying I can't stick needles into Spike's arm? No, of course not! Ugh. Um, hey, everybody! <clears throat> Yes, um, I have an announcement to make. Well, we do. Ooh, are we eating at Marco's Pizza now? <gasps> yeah, I love pizza. Especially with needles. Honey, shut up about the needles. <clears throat> Everybody. <sighs> I'm pregnant. Well, then. You I have a pomegranate? I am Pregos. Prego? Progresso? Isn't, isn't that like a soup? Oh. <clears throat> no, Prego. Oh, no, that's a, that's a sauce. That's a sauce. Yeah, Prego. Oh, oh, spaghetti. We're getting, we're getting a new spaghetti sauce, Mom. Oh my gosh, I have a baby in my stomach. You ate a baby? No! Ow. I think what she's saying is that she's pregnant with a baby. Oh. Yes, that's what I meant, and I need to order pizza now. Ooh, well, I'll help. Come on, Spike, let's leave the kids to talk. Okay, honey, I want to tell you exactly what I want on my pizza. Oh my gosh. Well, guys, you know what this means. Crying baby so I can stick needles in. We're gonna have the biggest beep storm ever. It's gonna be. We're gonna be. Well, well then, I guess me and Jerry will leave since. Everyone's you guys... gonna die. We're all gonna die. Well, I... come on, Jerry. Let's leave them with their family business. Okay, bye. Bye. We're all gonna die. We're gonna die. It was bad when Cherry Lee was born. But you, you can't even remember. Yes, I do. You cried so much, I almost jumped out the window. You were only when... two. Exactly. I was two when I jumped out the window. I don't even remember anyone being born. Well, because you're the last one being born. But actually, you were kind of quiet. But, you know, you tried sticking needles and all this. Well, actually, you know, you didn't. Because you weren't obsessed with needles at that time. Oh, Not yeah, I remember when you were normal. <laughs> Yeah, all you kind of did was is just sit there. And stare at you sing. soul. As when lollipops and rainbows and butterflies. You stared into our souls when you were... That's why she would stare at us when she was a baby. You know, when she would sleep, her eyes would be half open. Like, yeah, that was creepy. Dun, dun, I told mom about it, but she said it was normal. But back to the matter at hand. We're all gonna die. Let's name the child Bobby. Ooh, we yeah, are, but we should name it Bobby. Yeah, but I mean, I don't care if we have a new kid, sister or brother. Ugh. No, I'm the youngest and forever the youngest. And that I'll just means crying and poopy, flipping diapers. Isn't dad like that? It's gonna be like having another dad in the house. Oh, I need to go, I need to go <laughs> meditate. Isn't like a baby's like a grown up? I need son. to meditate on good things. I'm like, coming with you. Like, 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 Natals. like rainbows and rock star contests and that. Okay, I'm coming.